Yep. All right, so uh, today we're going to be working on a few passing and uh, shooting activities. And um, what I'm going to be showing you is modifications for a child with muscular dystrophy that is in a wheelchair. Um, because, because of this disease, they're not very strong, so a lot of the modifications involves uh, using lighter objects, uh, closer objects, just things that make it easier for them. Um, the first thing we'll be working on is a pass, and um, we'll, be, we'll be simulating a bounce pass. And I have pads laid out, the red pads, and this is also a way to assess, assess them to see how well they can, uh, how high the score they can get. The red pads are one point, the blue pads are two points, and the yellow pads that are the furthest will be three points. And the objective is to score uh, how, however high you can with five passes. So first we'll start off with a regular ball just to give them a feel for it. And uh, we'll have that. And you can sit back just a little bit if you want. And um, you go ahead, five, five passes. So one, two, so that's three. That's six points. Seven points. And that's nine points. Now, if they have trouble with the real ball, you can switch out to a lighter object. So I did bring the ball, and we'll just have them do it a few more times just to demonstrate that, then we'll move to our next one. You can go ahead. That's a two-pointer. Okay, so that's really a bounce pass. So next we'll kind of be demonstrating a chest pass. And with that, you want to be able, you have to let them extend their arms and really um, push the ball out. And we'll start out with a lighter ball on this. And the object is to give them a target, a uh, target big enough for them to succeed at the uh, activity. So what I'm gonna have them do is just um, try to make it through the hoop. And the better he gets, the more I can move around. And the further I can get him. And so forth. One more. Those are two activities for a child with muscular dystrophy.